show today. We're in Las Vegas, Nevada. What's happening on the show, Tommy? We got the eighth fittest woman from 2019, Bethany Shadburn. And we got the three-time fittest American woman, Carrie Pierce. Roll the foot. Okay, good morning. What's up, dude? We're at the Carrie Pierce's house and we got Bethany Shepard's special guest. Bethany Shepard. Let's get the braids. Yeah. Pigtail. Yeah, yeah, pigtail braids. Yeah, she's on the runner already. That was the warm up. Okay. Yeah. I'm warm. I'm warm. Tell me about it. What'd you do? Oh, it was just 10 minutes on the runner. Oh, okay. Yeah, that'll that'll get you going. 10 minutes of running, any kind of. Any kind of running. Yeah. Are you power As you can tell What's up? Power I am power rabbing. Okay. All day, every day, you know? Yeah, yeah. That's it. Why not? Are you power rabbing? Oh, yeah. I'm, I want to. Uh, We've been meaning to do laundry, so we came to the right house. So how long have you been in town? Since Sunday. Sunday. Okay. Uh -huh. And you've just been... It's going strong. Been training with... Yesterday or Sunday. Today starts kind of like the download a little bit or the deload a little bit. So, okay. yeah. Had nice training partners through all the intense workouts and stuff. I know they had fun. What brought you to Vegas? Uh, gyms in New York were closed and yeah. they, they were closed for a long, long time. They just opened up not too long ago and my coach owned a gym in New York and was just like, we can't make ends meet, we can't take care of our family. So him and his wife came to the gym one day and were like, we're moving to Vegas. Do you want to come? And I was like, uh, I don't know. And the next day I came in, I was like, sign me up, let's wow. go. Yeah, hey, yeah. you're about to hop in on the run right now? Yeah. <laughs> Like I'm running through the running through the hills of Oaxaca. Hi, hi. Seven fifty. Okay. Yeah, it was good. It was perfect. Yeah. You gonna tag in? Uh, you up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just waiting for you know my heat. Gotcha, gotcha. You're the final heat, right? Yeah, final heat. Yeah. Waiting for the heat to start, you know. What up now? We just rest, chill a little bit, eat a little bit, and yeah. then we head to the gym. So what's your, what's your favorite thing about living in this area? The number one thing is slower pace of life. Okay. I feel like in New York it was just like going, going, going. And I feel like since I've been here, I just have more time in my day. I had only been to the Strip before I moved here. Yeah. And I was like questioning Justin's decision on moving yeah, to Las Vegas because huh? it's... So much well, it's yeah. A lot, it's a lot like, different on the outskirts than just the Strip. Vegas yeah. isn't just the Strip for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, it's much, much different than just the Strip. So, but I had to figure that out after I moved here, so. Cool. And I did, and I like it, and now I might be suckering some other people to move in, yeah. move here with me. Yeah. <laughs> you. Did you spit into a cup yet? I, I did, it's at, oh, I just put it in my car because I was like, if I don't have this in my car, then I'm gonna forget it. So I did it yesterday. I had a lady watch me, yeah, spit into the cup for five minutes. That was fun. Yeah. How, much, how much did you have to fill up? How much did you talk about? It's like this much. Oh, Where we go right now? Yeah, this is Margo's wine, but it's a uh, bottled in Paso Robles, 2018 red wine. I think it has goat hoofs. It gives good collagen. Yeah, yeah it's collagen. a good collagen. Yeah, it's yeah, it's, it's a protein wine. Yeah, it's a protein wine. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're gonna see you at CrossFit. Combination. Combination. It's all gonna come together Bye. today. Goodbye. Okay, so we're trying to leave, we're but the car's leave. gone. We gotta Tommy get took rain. the van. He, he, he had to take a. He, he takes to, big shits. Yeah, big shits. When people steal money and then they have the money with the paint bag and it explodes, it's like that. <laughs> he didn't want to put Gary Pierce through that because we were here at the house. And now we come outside and he's taking our car. <laughs> How was your conference call? I haven't gone. I haven't gone on my conference call, but I just finished it actually. But I'm hurting right now. We need to go. <laughs> someone, someone navigate. I, I can barely think. <laughs> <laughs> can I be there when it goes down? Oh, dude, I was like cramping out here. <laughs> just kidding. I don't want to be there. This is getting weird. Oh, there's a hydrant there, bro. Yeah. <laughs> what if a fire truck comes? He's got a sweat mark on his ass. <laughs> I don't know if this is good, but I can definitely see this yeah, one. Yeah. You see this one? Yeah, I saw the sweat. Oh, okay. I can, yeah. Tommy got his shit out. Yeah, he First did. Of all, we got yeah. that taken care it of. was messy. Second we didn't, of we didn't, we didn't did film you see it. it. No, I heard it though. They call them tremors. We're about to go hot. Yeah. Boom, there you go. That's for you. Thanks. There you go, boys. Cheers. Or not. That cheers. And look who just walked in. These are my fashions. I can't believe you're not running right now. 
Those yeah. do look quick. Those are yeah. very cheap. I know, they're fast. You better watch out. Yeah, you can really hit depth in those. What am I lifting flats? I'm a are big dog be? guy, as you know. He's super cool. What a good guy. Super chill. Look at this guy. He's got like the, the Yoda ears. Yeah. I'm liking this guy. <laughs> a good morning. Oh, hey, good morning. Good morning. Hi. Hi. What's Hi. up first? You got back squats? Uh, yes. Back okay. squats, then snatches, oh. and EMOM. Okay. And then accessory. Okay. And power abs. I don't think it's a competition. Look at little Marjan back there learning how to use a bike. So proud of you, buddy. Did you attend? I don't think he did. I think he's cheating. He probably scaled it halfway through and did nine. <laughs> oh, hey, go on, Tom. Tell me what you want to stretch. How did stage one go? Uh, it went good. Otherwise, I don't think we would be talking. The first couple weren't my game. Well, the first one was I. Went out a little too hot, like I think most people. Friendly Fran, did you guys do that at all? I did, I did. I went out tapered and then slowed down. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is a technique I use too. Yeah. It's all right. Yeah. I'm like a four out of 10. But then I ended up 15th place after the first block. Okay. So it's not, you know, sitting pretty. And then we got up to 11th. And then we moved to 7th. And then was able to get to that fifth. Okay. Next right. place spot Go. and into the yeah. games. And that means how many years in a row? Six years in a row. Jeez. Six timer. My weight! <laughs> What's happening here? Oh man, I can't help myself. This guy's so cute. Look at this guy. Yeah, we're doing snatches. It's just a six minute EMOM, one rep for quality. All I do is quality. Okay, got it. She did it! I always like the CrossFit Games because there's always random things that you don't do in training or like that you don't know is coming. Like when like they bring out the pig flips or like the pegboard for the first time or the snail, like just different things that you have to learn on the fly. What are you seeing that you're like, oh, this is it. This is mine. I, anything with handstands. You see the bowler shoulders? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I actually, yeah, you've got. Yeah, I got it. In fact, I was like, I'll angle you a little bit. You know, the, I don't think it's working. You know, you got the, the say, front like, on angle. Biceps like Briggs. I'm like, biceps like, like dude. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Know you. Know what I'm thank Jeez. you. You did? Yeah! Did you do it? <laughs> yeah! Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna have a bump there. So what's going on? What's happening? What's happening? I don't know. She's about Gary to break Baskin. it down. Gary Bears, I hear. Are you guys ready? Are yeah, you guys yeah, ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got 20 minute E-mom. Boom! Okay. 20 minutes. Wow. Boom! Yep. Yeah. Four, four movements though. Okay. So five rounds. 12 calories on the Echo Bike. And then we got 30 double unders with the new fancy rope that we got from stage one. And then we have five ring muscle ups. Okay. And then 10, 10 dumbbell snatches, but 35 pounds, so. Nice and light. I'm excited about that. Would you say those. muscle ups are your favorite thing in the world? I, I love muscle ups. Yeah. Uh, handstands are my favorite. Thing, oh really? Though. Any okay. kind of handstands, push ups, handstand. Handstand walking is like the top of the top. How do you like staying, not moving? Ah, uh, it was hard. It yeah. was different. It, as a gymnast, we did a lot of it, but yeah. I haven't in like years. Yeah, how, because uh, I, how long did you hold? Two minutes and thirteen seconds. Oh, what was, but what not was, in was one place. What like was second place. I was second. Oh, Katrin was first with like two, almost three minutes, which is amazing. And Danielle Brandon, who went right before me and I saw her go, got two minutes and 12 seconds. So you got her by a second? I got her by a second. Oh, wow. All right, these guys are gonna do the workout. I'm gonna film it, I'm gonna sit out. I've had enough fitness. I ain't a games athlete. Squatting's good enough. What do we know? Next weekend, I think you're gonna have to take like a lot of chances. You're gonna have to go hard in all of these workouts. As I said earlier, the girls are super fit. We're all putting in a lot of work because we all wanna be on that podium and everyone is gonna give their heart and soul to get in the top three. My personality, I've, I'm a perfectionist and I've been that way my entire life. Like I was talking to my dad about it the other day and he's like, even from when you were like really young and started gymnastics, like you were always a perfectionist. With my family, we play, we like to play board games and stuff, and like the game of life or Monopoly, things like that. Like I always have 
to win. Fifth place, two years, and one including last year, and I'm ready to go on that podium. Last year I made a mistake on the rings, I fell off, and I know like I could kind of feel my opportunity slip away, but this is the closest that I've ever been, and I've put in a lot of work this last year, so I deserve a spot on the podium. Okay, well, now what? What's up? Now we got your successory. Okay. It's a new term that I just learned. Yeah, we have uh, some single leg reverse hypers. Okay. We got some dumbbell bench press. Oh, I'll do that. I got yeah. That. I'm on all that. And then we have some inclined dumbbell rows. We got some Polish rows. And then single arm dumbbell overhead squats. You're just, this is all for intimidation. You're, yeah. Yeah, kind of intimidating. So we did the actual workout. Now we got to get the pump on. Yeah, yeah, pump. I mean, it, you, you got the pump going, you know? Thank you, thank yeah, you. That's yeah. all that muscle up. Yeah, yeah. Just got any lower than it looks bigger. Yeah. Are we having a flex off? Yeah. Look at that. Look at the old oh And I, I'm not even allowed to do bicep curls. What do you mean? My coach doesn't let me do bicep curls. He said my biceps get in the way of my front rack, which you can kind of see if this is the problem. Oh, I used to do them all the time. Yeah, I got the same. You got the same problem, right? Yeah, I got the second yeah, touch yeah, my gets, shoulders. Gets in the way of my, uh, my, my jerk. Building that big back. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, just me and the girls over here hanging out, get some fitness on. I don't know what Tommy's doing. He's got long limbs. Can't do a bench press. It's too much of a rom. Like like After this, she's got core. Oh yeah. Don't forget your core. Yeah. <laughs> you you can't. That's yeah. the most important part. Yeah. Save best for last. I, I've learned if exactly. you blow out your core, nothing else works. I, it's literally, real. like I can't do anything. It was a week ago. Thanks a lot, Noah. Here we go. Workout data provided by Whoop. Okay. Wow. So you tell us you're the fittest you've ever been. I want to talk about your resting heart rate for the last week. What's your resting heart rate? Well, Whoop here says it's a 36. 36. 36. That's like. Boop. Boop. Yeah, yeah. We, I haven't even heard of something that slow. Mine's 63. I'm almost double you. Yeah. My coach was like, some days I wonder if you're even alive because yeah. your heart even beating. Yeah. Man. That is a low. But your average recovery this week is in 69%. Yep. 69%. 69%. Were you uh, at? 53, oh, yeah. Oh man, you gotta get on that uh, beam I'm falling green, off, man. all this traveling, man. I'm, I'm, okay. I'm ready to take a coma. Now let's slide on over to your the weekly performance assessment. I wanna talk about your average day strain on the final week of actually going hard before you start to tape before the CrossFit Games. What we got? Mm -hmm. What's your average day strain last week? We're at a 17.1. Dang, okay. Yeah. Let me- uh, Putting I'll, in some I'll, work. I'll do you one better. What's a 9.7? What does that do? I'm 12.5. <laughs> yeah, that, that's where your, your half is here, yep. and then your double in the resting heart rate, I've I got think. A big heart though. Yeah, you got a big working heart. Yep. You got a, your yeah. day strain compared to women your age is 39% higher than average. Wow. All that fitness, that's how we get fit. Absolutely. My day strain compared to my men my age, about the same. <laughs> about the same, about all the right. Same. Fit right in. Shout out right to the Butter Gang, here Butter we go. Gang. We're gonna have her pick a number between one and 10,000. Give it to me. 7,177. Okay. They even go down that uh, far. 10,000. That's, that's, that's a lot of people. We got a big uh, big butter gang, you know? Yeah, that's really cool. You could use code pancakes, that'll get you into the butter gang, and then uh, use it again to get your whoop. You'll save 15%, that's what's up. Hernan Benitez. Found it. 14.0 is the average daily strain. The day strain. daily strain. Okay, so he's still Hernan. straining. Tell me about him. He what just, does he know? He just started since August of 2020. Okay, new to the gang. He's done some functional Welcome. fitness, is all activities. Hernan Benitez, hit us up. Slide into the DMs. Get That's the butter gang, and we out. Bye, honey. Yo, here we go. We're saying goodbye Bye, to Carrie honey. Pierce. Hey. Thank you so much for having us out. Oh yeah. yeah, so glad you guys came. And good luck, you know, Thank big you. big next week. I uh, wish you the best. We'll get the best finish ever. Yes. All right. That's what we're going for. Up next, you do you going? want do you want me to tell them where we're going next? Hi, buddy. Where are we going next? The CrossFit Games. The CrossFit Games. Yeah. Tell them about this it. This is us telling you. We'll be there. We'll so. be there. What's up, people? See you later, bro. Thanks for coming out. And 
Thanks, good hanging guys. out with you, dude. Good seeing you. So, yeah, and we'll see you next week, maybe. Yeah, All right. come hang out in California. All right. Later, people. Uh, as you can tell, my energy is real high. It's been a long road trip. We out.